My God, Arthur C. Clarke is unmatched. They do not make sci-fi like this anymore. Dudes, this is the news we've all been waiting for. The Dune trailer has been confirmed. The Dune trailer will be releasing in August. Multiple theater chains have leaked this information, so let's get into the bits of news that we have right now. First off, we've got an article from Screen Rant. First Dune movie trailer releasing in August. After several months of waiting, the first trailer for Denis Villeneuve's Dune will arrive in August, with Warner Brothers pre-release of Inception. Now we've heard this before, but this seems way more solid, and I'll tell you the reason why in just a second. The first trailer for Denis Villeneuve's Dune will arrive in August. Frank Herbert's iconic 1965 novel has been adapted multiple times before, but none have managed to properly translate the expansive sci-fi world. Now Villeneuve will attempt to do what others have failed at in creating a better adaptation, and expectations are certainly high. Yes, they are. Now the first leak that we have came from a Danish theater chain. According to the Danish theater, Palette's Tietret, I'm probably not saying that right, the very first trailer for Dune will arrive next month in August. It will be featured in theaters alongside the re-release of Inception, which is currently slated for August 21st. So there you have it guys. Dune trailer releasing August 21st. Now let's get into the other news that backs this news up. Now, a Portuguese theater chain known as Cinema City has also confirmed that the Dune trailer will be releasing during the re-release of the movie Inception. And it says here, if you're a fan of the movie Inception, 10 years after its world premiere, Cinema City will exhibit the work of Christopher Nolan, who will also have exclusive images from the films Tenet and Dune. More news coming soon. So there you have it guys, two independent sources in two different countries confirming the release of the Dune trailer August 21st. It seems like it's actually going to happen this time. We kind of had the rug snatched from under us previously and it's led a lot of us to speculate that maybe Dune isn't coming out this year and Dune probably might still maybe not come out this year. Who really even knows, timey wimey, wibbly wobbly, whatever, but the trailer could still come out. And we've been inkling to see the trailer for so long, for so long. We've seen almost nothing. We've just gotten a few images. And I really feel as though seeing this trailer will take the hype for Dune to a whole new level and bring the excitement for this movie to an entirely new level. Because I look at the excitement that we just saw for the Foundation trailer, and that's not coming out until 2021, confirmed at the very earliest. So if Dune's coming out in December, which let's see if it does, they need to put out a trailer pretty darn soon. And not only that, this trailer absolutely has to make a major impression. It has to make a bigger impression than the Foundation trailer. It has to do pretty much everything right. And you know, they pretty much got trailer making down to a science now, like a lot of movies that are completely terrible have excellent trailers. But then again, Dune is not a typical story really and oftentimes a trailer can make or break a movie and even alter the way the movie is perceived by the public ultimately when they go and watch it. This happens a lot of times with more art house type horror films like perhaps The Babadook or Mother which aren't typical horror movies. They're not like The Conjuring. They're more metaphorical and even non-linear and kind of heady and more cerebral. But oftentimes these movies are marketed as standard horror movies. So when general audiences go to see these films, they're disappointed. So it'll be a line to balance in this trailer between showing the epicness of Dune and then showing the real point of Dune, which is the philosophy and the meanings behind all of this, which is something that I can tell is very important to Denis Villeneuve because it is a story that he's wanted to adapt his entire life. So I won't go on and on guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe for more videos on Dune and other great science fiction and fantasy book series. You know this movie's gonna be woke garbage, right? No one's gonna see it. It's gonna suck. Leah Kynes is a female. Organism. Denis Villeneuve is a hell. And excellent.